Welcome to Science 101. How do humans change our planet? Some of these have been for the better, while others have been for the worse. The rapid increase in the world's population has drastically increased the demand for natural resources. The depletion of Earth's natural resources leads to adverse effects on the environment. These include various types of pollution. Preventive measures must be taken to stop the situation from worsening. By the end of this video, students will be able to understand that our actions can harm the environment. Identify examples of how human activities can pollute the land, water, and air. Realize the importance of taking care of the environment and making choices that help protect it. Today, we're diving into a topic that affects our planet. Pollution It's when harmful substances make our environment dirty and unsafe as a result of human activities. There are three types of pollution, land, water, and air pollution. Let's explore each type and learn how we can protect our environment. Land pollution Land pollution is the contamination of soil and land surfaces caused by human activities that make them polluted and unhealthy. It occurs when people throw garbage and waste on the ground instead of putting it in proper places. Practice improper farming by using excessive chemical fertilizers and pesticides, and cut down too many trees. These human activities can hurt animals and plant habitats. Every year, the population of Earth rises. They need greater space to live and work. They need additional food as well. Huge sections of forest are removed to give space for building homes, expanding cities, and growing food for human consumption. These activities cause land pollution called deforestation. Another is water pollution. Water pollution is the contamination of water bodies, usually as a result of human activities. Factories and households produce wastewater that often contains harmful chemicals and waste and finds its way into rivers and lakes, polluting the water. Dumping trash directly into bodies of water also contributes to water pollution. These substances contaminate the water, making it unsafe for aquatic life and even for us to use. Have you ever wondered how we get to school or go on exciting trips to different places? One of the ways we travel is by using different modes of transportation, like cars, buses, trains, planes, and ships. But did you know that these vehicles can sometimes cause pollution? Vehicles rely on fuels like gasoline and diesel to operate. Sometimes, when it rains, water washes away pollutants present on roads such as oil, gasoline, and debris. This runoff flows into storm drains, which eventually lead to rivers, lakes, or an accident in which oil has come out of a ship known as oil spills that contaminate oceans, making it harmful for plants, animals, and even humans. Lastly, air pollution. Air pollution occurs when gases, dust, smoke, or odors get into the air and make it unclean. Have you ever looked up at the sky and noticed a thick layer of smog or dark clouds? One of the reasons for air pollution is human activities like burning forests for other purposes that release harmful substances into the air. Vehicles, such as cars, trucks, and buses, also contribute to air pollution by emitting pollutants from gasoline and diesel. Part of it are the factories. Factories often rely on the burning of fossil fuels like coal, oil, and natural gas to generate energy for their operations. When these fuels are burned, they release pollutants. These pollutants can cause respiratory problems, contribute to the formation of smog, and harm plants and animals. 
They can harm our health, the environment, and the balance of our planet. In summary, we explored how human activities can have a significant impact on the environment, contributing to land, water, and air pollution, and how they can harm the planet and living organisms. We must all work together to protect the planet's health and well-being. Quiz time. Grab a pencil and paper. And get ready. Check your answer. Thank you for watching. If you find this video helpful, please like, share and subscribe.